up guys, Tobias here and welcome to this week's Team of the Week. It has literally just been released by EA and the time is 7 past 3 so they're a little bit late today but nonetheless no surprise being late with the FIFA demo yesterday. But anyway, this is this week's FIFA 12 Ultimate Team Team of the Week. As you can see, it is on your screen now. I'm just going to run through it. I'm not going to be too long. Don't want to drag this video out too long. Just going to cover the starting 11 and there goes my Skype and then I'll just look over the benches briefly. So uh, first of all then, up front we have is Izabizovic, I think that's pronounced Ibizovic, something along those lines. My pronunciation is absolutely dreadful, but he's a 82 rated striker. He's got some nice stats, 83 shooting, which isn't too bad, 83 heading as well, along with 80 dribbling. He is only an 82 rated striker, so he won't be too much. Then we've got Dzeko up front as well from Manchester City. He's been upgraded to an 85 striker. He is quite old, so uh, his pace isn't the highest. Uh, however, look at shooting, 86 shooting, that's extremely high, along with 83 dribbling, which again is quite high he's 85 again he is a premiership striker in form so he is going to go for quite a lot and then finally in the striker we've got Asvaldo then the Italian striker from Roma uh, he's been upgraded to 83 he's also got 80 shooting 68 passing uh, 78 dribbling 57 defending and the best stat there is 85 heading which is extremely high for an 83 rated striker I'm gonna start on the left hand side then on the midfield we've got Seedorf um, the newly transferred Netherlands center attacking mid player um, 61 pace which is extremely low however look at that shooting and passing together and as well dribbling with 85 we've got three stats there being over 85 85 shooting passing 87 and dribbling 85 it is an only 84 rated center attack and mid so I don't know how he's not even 85 rated overall next one then in the center mid position as a center attacking mid we've got Tom Cleverley uh, pace 82 78 shooting passing 86 which is extremely high and again 85 dribbling as well so he He's got some high stats for a low overall rating. Um, next in then we've got Abu Dhabi. Uh, pace 80, which again, don't have a quick squad this week. 79 shooting, passing 75, dribbling is extremely high. Seems to be a main feature in this week's Team of the Week. And then defending 78 and heading 74. And then finally in the midfield, we've got Manalev. Um, the 74 rated, the one of two silver players in the starting 11. 79 pace, 63 shooting, 80 passing, dribbling 73. Defending 70 and then finally heading 64. Um, moving on to the midfield, then our uh, midfield, the defence, beg your pardon. Starting in the middle, we've got Company, uh, the second 85 rated player in this week's starting 11. Pace 74, um, 61 shooting, 74 passing, and dribbling 71. And then these last two stats are the most important being the centre back 88 defending, which is extremely high, and heading 83. Next to him, then on the right hand, right -hand side, we've got Yanga Mabiwa. I think I don't know how it's pronounced. The, um, the French centre back again he's got 71 pace 42 shooting 71 passing <clears throat> dribbling 52 defending 88 and heading 50 Five. So if anything, he is better than company. If you can compare both their stats there, even though he's only an 82 rated centre centre back, he's got 88 defending and 85 heading. So he is absolute beast. Um, I don't know how he's again only rated 82 when he's got those two stats. It's most probably going to be his dribbling and shooting which is letting him down. And then finally, out of the midfield players, and there's my Skype going again. We've got that player, which I don't even know what nationality that is. Um, um, Kazakhstan, uh, Kazakhstan, yeah. Um, which I'm not even going to try and pronounce how to. I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. But he's got. He's 73. He's the second of the two. Um, silver players in this week starting at 11 82 pace 75 shooting passing 66 71 dribbling defending 73 and finally he has got 65 heading so that is the out uh, field players then we've got Ben Aguilio, um from Switzerland I believe um, yep um, he's only he's only been upgraded to 81 um, however he has got 85 diving which is extremely high as well as 83 reflexes and then finally 81 positioning so it is a fairly solid starting 11 we're just going to run through Nelson we've got the goal Manchester City goalkeeper who had a good week um, as well as him we've got I'm not even going to try and pronounce that um, then we've got Salcido um, who's here we've got Strootman the Netherlands centre attacking mid from PSV again we've got a Brasilva here Austin from Leeds uh, he's got some nice stats there so he'll be going for quite a bit especially with the league he's in uh, so we've got Salza um, the second Bra uh, Brazilian uh, have we got another Brazilian? Could have sworn I just saw another Brazilian. Did I just say 
I think I must have just said Austin was a Brazilian, but he's actually Jamaican. Uh, so he's got 61 pace, 80 shooting, 53 passing, 60 dribbling, 66 defending, and 77 heading. And then finally, we've got Pope, the English striker. He's only a bronze, one of two bronze in this week's team of the week. 62 pace, 69 shooting, 53 passing, 54 dribbling, 55 defending, and 82 heading. So that is this week's team of the week. I can imagine everyone is going to be going for those Premiership players. Uh, such as DRB, um, uh, Cleverly, Company, and uh, who's that? Uh, Jekko. I can't even get his name off my tongue. So uh, please leave your comments in the comment section below who you are hoping to get in this week's Team of the Week. I can imagine everyone isn't going to be buying much because FIFA 13 is literally round the corner now. Uh, but please do leave your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. I am going to be trying to get Cleverly, being a United fan, I'm going to open some packs this week because I haven't opened packs in an absolute fortune time uh, but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video please do click that share button and share it on twitter it does help out my channel a great deal uh, thanks for all the support you've given me in the last few weeks and until my next video i'll be speaking to you guys later take care